Hello, so today I'm going to show you how to install the Town of Us mod. Uh, so this is not the GitHub mod, this is Town of Us R or R with Submerged. This is the continuation that is unofficial, it is unrelated to the original Town of Us mod. The original Town of Us is discontinued and is no longer receiving updates, so this is where you have to go to get your Town of Us mod pack. So the first thing you want to do is open up your web browser and make sure you have this link pasted up in as the URL. This link will be in the description of the video so it's easy to access. If you're too lazy to click on the description of the video, you can always search up Town of Us mod. Do not click GitHub, click on amongus-us.net. So today I'm actually going to install the mod with the mod manager. So if you don't know how this works, you just click on install with the mod manager. It'll open up this other uh, window. Now this is Spanish. If you want to take the time to translate, you can. Basically, you just need to click on this red button. It's the same as all of these buttons that were translated to English. This page is uh, just a little late on the translation. So make sure you click on this and it will download uh, an EXE. From there, you just want to open up where it downloaded from and make sure you run the EXE. So I already have this downloaded. I'm not sure if it will allow me to download it again. You're just going to follow these steps uh, as they pop up. You can create a desktop shortcut if you want. I personally don't see the need. I can always search up the mod manager whenever I need to install new mods. So I'm going to click on next and install. And I already have this installed, so it's, uh, it's already telling me that I need to close the application. I'm just going to click on automatically close. You should not have this step. Once you're done, you can launch the mod manager and uh, it should pop up just in a moment. If it does not, you can always search it up in the taskbar or if you did make a desktop shortcut, it will be on your desktop. So here is the mod manager and it's still taking time to load. So there's different mods that you can add. Not all of these mods are associated uh, with the web page up top. However, most of them are. The mod that you are going to be looking for right now is the Town of Us R. This is the version 3.2.0 and you're just going to click on this downwards arrow to download the mod. At the bottom, it'll load and it should automatically apply. So to launch the mod, you're then going to click on this play button and it should open up your game. It may take a moment for your game to launch and that's okay. That's just the mod showing that it's loading everything up before it can actually launch the game itself. So if it takes a while to load, it just might be a sign that your game is loading the mod correctly. So we're just gonna wait one moment while this loads. and it's still loading. And here we are. So if you this is your first time launching the game, it could be quite loud. It is quite loud for me. However, I don't think my recording is actually picking it up. We're just going to click on I understand. And clearly the mod has properly loaded as it says Town of Us right here. I'm going to quickly turn my volume down. So when we click on online, we can click on create a game. I'm just going to confirm. And on the left, we can already see that most of the rules have already displayed properly. You can click on here. And if you are running the server yourself, or if you're hosting your own game, you'll have this new tab called town of us. You can change the percentage of each different uh, rule. You can even disable certain rules that you don't like. All of the rule descriptions will be displayed on the Town of Us uh, mod page. So if you want to scroll down and you want extra information about a rule that maybe you're not familiar with, then you can come here and you can click on any rule that is displayed. 
For example, if you're not really sure what a snitch does, you can click on snitch and it will display information. My internet is not quite good enough to load that right now. There is also a brief description of the role that you are going to be playing in the game whenever the game launches and it displays the role that you have received. For example, Altruist may get a description stating that they can sacrifice themselves to revive a dead crewmate, and that is basically what the Altruist role does. If you're having any other issues downloading the mod, I would recommend reinstalling Among Us from scratch, making sure that the Among Us folders are already deleted completely, and then installing a fresh uh, installation of the game. If that still is not working for you, I would strongly recommend uh, verifying the integrity of your files. Try to confirm that your mod is downloading to the correct space. However, the mod installer that we downloaded using the exe file already takes care of the installation for us. So if the mod installer is not working for you, try following the steps on the website uh, and try to do a manual installation of the game. Uh, I would also like to say that if you are playing with the Dragon's Hollow Discord, then I would strongly recommend getting better crew link. Simply click on the downwards arrow like you did with the Town of Us, and it should install automatically. You may need to close your game for this. I'm trying it without closing my game. It may automatically close my game. I'm not quite sure yet, but the two mods that we're going to be playing with is Better Crew Link and Town of Us R. So make sure that those are both installed and up to date. 